Hello. All right. So uh, this is something totally different. Never done this before. I was at my local comic shop. It's called the Dork Den, a place I frequent a lot. Anyways, they had like a, a sale for denizens. Denizens, like if you um, uh, sp spend a little bit of money there, whatever, you buy a membership and then you get a discount for everything you buy. Um, which is you know, a nice little deal. It's 15% off, and after a while it adds up, and you actually make more off of it than uh, than you would uh, not buying it. So, anyways, uh, I saw this there, and I was like, well, what the heck? And maybe I'll even do a little video of it now. You can see it is still sealed. It's still sealed. I have no clue what's in it. And so, um, I don't know. I, I do like comics. And I'm hoping that we get some good stuff in here. It'll dictate whether or not I uh, decide to buy some more. So, let's see what we get. I think I'll take them out like one by one. That'll be kind of the best way to do it. Alright. Get this open. And let's see what we get. Now, there looks like there's about ten comics in here, I think is what they were saying. So, first one. We have an Uncanny Origins featuring Cyclops. This would be a dollar comic from 1996. Um, yeah, it's okay. I mean, it's it's a it's obviously a a, a kid one. Um, I'm not much of a Marvel fan. I'm more. I mean, I like Marvel. Don't get me wrong, but uh, you know, given the choice, I do prefer DC comics in general. The Marvel movies I prefer overall because they're great, but to prefer the comics from DC. So. First comic is uh, Cyclops. And you can see it's a dollar comic. Let's see what our next one is. It is a DC. It is Firestorm. Oh, cool. It is an Infinite Crisis. Firestorm starring Donna Troy. I do like Firestorm. He's cool. He's cool. That's a $2 comic. So we already have $3 in value, and I didn't spend. There was a denizen sale, so I think I got 25% off. So I already got my uh, decent amount of value out of it. Let's see what my next comic is. Nightbreed. It's a Clive Barker. Clive Barker. Nightbreed. It's number 11. I don't know very much about it. I know Clive Barker is known for his, like, um, horror stories kind of, that kind of thing. Uh, that's interesting. I've never seen it before. Uh, it's a $4 comic. So, uh, we'll just check it out. Next one. It is Warbound. World War Hulk After Smash. Um, well, this is the number one. That's kind of cool. Um, it's a one of five. It's a limited series of five. You see there. It is a Marvel um, this would be after the World War Hulk series, I believe. Uh, which is kind of what I, I've heard the new movies are going to be. Like, the new Thor movie is going to have Hulk, and he may be in his armor and whatnot. That's kind of interesting. I'm glad to get a number one. Number one, that's already a pretty good deal right there. Still have a bunch more. Next one. Oh, cool. What is this? The Wit and Wisdom of Zen. Now, this one's kind of beat up a little bit, but... Uh, it looks interesting. I mean, something like, I, I work with kids, so what I'll probably do is, this one looks like a good one to kind of bring in and, uh, let the kids play around with. Zenism. Let's, what do you say? We just crack this one open and see what the heck it is. The case is just mangled, so we're just going to throw that out anyways, probably. Let's see what this is. Zen. Huh. The wit and wisdom of Zen. <laughs> Here's a piece of my free advice. Shut your mouth and open your mind. Well, this is interesting. Weird comic. It's not even a comic. It's like strange. I've never seen anything like that before. All right. Well, that goes right there. That goes in the very strange pile. <laughs> Time Spirits. I have no clue what this one is. Time Spirits. Strange. It is an epic comic. Marvel. Marvel epic comic. It was a dollar. Oh, that's interesting. I've never seen anything before like that. Next one. Tomb Raider. 
It is the number one, which is kind of cool. Did you get a Tomb Raider comic? Uh, yeah, it's a dark horse. Looks cool. I do like the illustrations. They look great. I don't know what they'll be inside, but it's worthy to get a to get a Tomb Raider, even if it's a, a Tomb Raider, but a number one. That's kind of cool. There are three left, it looks like. Next comic. Oh, cool. Adventures of Superman. The special crime unit is recruiting. Can you make the cut? That looks like Punisher. Like a really bad version of Punisher. <laughs> uh, this is a uh, 90s, 90s comic. You can tell the, the art is very, very 90s, late 90s. Um, but still kind of cool. That there, I got two more in here. Let's see where the next one is. Clandestine Marvel Comics. They live among us. Beware. Yeah, they're they're giving some just like their oddest oddball comics. Um, looks crazy. I don't know. Um, looks like ones I'll bring to bring to school and let them play with. See if they enjoy reading them. Last one. Fantastic Force. Um, it, it, that, fantastic, it's Sue Richard, okay, so it is, uh, part of the Fantastic Four series, looks like, Fantastic Force, that's what that is, alright, so how many comics did I get total, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, so ten comics total, um, kind of a, a an odd mis mismatch of weird comics, um, I, I got a couple number ones, which is kind of cool. Uh, some oddball comics. I'm going to keep the Firestorm for sure, um, because that's a, uh, a DC. So I'll keep that one for sure. Uh, the X Men one, mm, meh, whatever. Fantastic Four. <laughs> These here's some bizarre. The Superman I'll keep for sure, even though it's an older one. I'll keep that. Tomb Raider. I'm I'm interested. In. I want to check this one out. The rest of these, this, this Wit and Wisdom of Zen is a bizarre comic. So, this was uh, my comic grab bag. It was a blind bag. Uh, yeah, tell me if uh, you know anything about some of these comics. Um, if they're good, worth reading, or whatnot. Leave it in the comics. Otherwise, uh, thanks for watching. Give me a thumbs up. And if you enjoy the video, give me a like. Uh, subscribe, whatever. Okay, uh, thanks for watching, and I will see you later.